Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Crystal and I'm a cash stuffer. And what that means is I stuff cash into cash envelopes and I have different binders where I keep up with my cash envelopes, my sinking funds, and also saving challenges that I participate in. Um, last week, I didn't make any videos just because, you know, Christmas was around the corner. It was, you know, last week and I had three different Christmases to get ready for and it was, you know, a stressful week. So I'm um, coming back and doing the last uh, budget with me video here with the, the last budget with me for December. So, yeah, so we're going to uh, be working with $408 this week. 408 and this week it's not as much as normal because most of this is Christmas money that I did get so most of that's going to be going to my envelope um, because I did get it for Christmas so for this week in my cash envelopes which I have these separated um, this is my cash envelopes my sinking funds and my savings challenges so for spending and takeout, we're not gonna do uh, be putting any cash in there. For groceries, we're only gonna be doing twenty dollars. Um, just because uh, this week we did already go grocery shopping and we had enough from last week, so I'm not putting that much in this week. And I did have someone comment asking me, you know, how am I able to put very little in my groceries? Well, I do live at home right now with family, so everyone, you know, puts their part in, so I don't have to put as much into our my groceries envelope. Um, for my girls, I may be putting five dollars. For Starbucks cups, I'm gonna put five, and for family fun, I'm gonna put five as well. I'm gonna turn it in the angle just so it's easier for me to write. And then for my envelope, this is where we're going to be putting a big chunk of it. It's uh, 215 I did get um, $180 in Christmas money, and then I returned some stuff. And then I'm also putting an additional $5. So that's why it's more for these my, my envelope. And then for Brooklyn and Emily, we're going to be putting 5 And also for my husband, Joseph. For my nephews and my niece, I'm going to be putting in $3. And then when I do my uh, cash stuffing, you're going to see the amounts a little bit different because I did stuff my envelopes last week. I just didn't put it on video just because, like I said, it was a busy week last week. And then for savings, we're going to be putting $3. And then also I'll show you my savings and my, I believe, debt envelope those came down a lot and I will explain in my next video for my cash stuffing then for birthdays and gifts we're gonna be adding three dollars Christmas we're gonna add five we're already gonna start building up for next year and then for my mom and Joseph we didn't have any vendor shows this weekend and our next show isn't gonna be until January 8th so we're kind of you know, that's another reason why we don't have as much uh, going into my envelopes because we don't have any shows, but we have had um, a few uh, sales outside of our vendor markets. So for vacation fund, we're gonna add $4. Travel money, we're gonna add two. The same for siblings trip, two. Debt, we're gonna put five. For credit card, we're gonna add five. Emergency, just gonna add one. Medical, three. Braces, three. And I'm just the rest of these are gonna be three dollars. And then for January, in February, I'm gonna try to build up my debt because I did get my husband a um, computer for Christmas. And I did, uh, like I mentioned before, I opened up a Wells Fargo credit card and I didn't, I don't have um, interest on it for I think 15 months. 
So the money that I've been saving up for him here, that's going to go towards it. And maybe his uh, vendor money is going to go towards it. And then anything I collect in my credit card envelope, uh, not so much my debt. I don't think my debt, but my credit card envelope and just pay that off as soon as possible. And then I also do get um, cash back for using my card. So that's a good deal. So that's why. I, and, and I believe once I use $1,000 within the first three months, which I'm close to um, reaching that, I will get $200 uh, back as well. So, so for my savings challenges here, for mine, I, we're going to add 22. Brooklyn and Emily, we're going to add five each my weight loss this one i'm not putting anything right now i'm gonna start on this i started but then of course i stopped because of the holidays so i'm gonna go i'm gonna zero it out and i'm gonna start over in january just so i can focus on that and not the holidays and then my christmas mini this is my last uh week to fill this one up or actually it's my last bonus just so I can finish out my Christmas mini and then I will start my uh, mini savings binder. And then for my savings box, I'm gonna be putting in 20, 10, and five. So yeah, so let's add up all these categories and it should equal it out to 408. So for this one, it's 20, 25, 30, 35. And then this one, two eighty one, ninety two, and then add all these up. 408, so that is correct. So yeah, so that's my budget with me, uh, my last budget with me for 2021. And I hope you guys had an awesome Christmas and you guys have a safe New Year's. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.